Hello everyone, today in this video we will be discussing the 5th uh, module super important question of the SADP which is very easy question yet it is worth 7 marks. So this document is for, can be found in the TIEs uh, like the website for the module 5 super important questions. Okay, you can download that many other questions also that you can go through it. So make sure the like button subscribe and subscribe for like this and let's get started. What you have to remember in the architecture of client server system. Client means who send the request who ask any question like that. that uh, uh, those things are called as client. Okay, and server is what? Server is who answers the uh, queries and has the storage and the data and handles the queries, all those things. Okay, so I have to draw two uh, two part of structure. Here you have to draw some triangles. Here one triangle. All of these are called as client and this is called as server. What is written inside that? Don't worry about that. And then after you, well, that, uh, what you have to write is the client runs a program. Uh, the client has a program which is called as user interface. By user interface, the client will send any request to the server. Okay, that is what uh, here it is. And it may or may not be graphical user interface. It might be normal user interface as well, just for sending the command. That's the first line you will be writing. Then <clears throat> the server hosts an object-oriented system. Inside that, you will be writing object-oriented system, where if the uh, queries come, it will be able to handle those queries and find out the solution and send back to the client. Okay, and since uh, the client sends a request to the server, the object system process the request and send the result uh, back to the client okay so a so request is sent to the server and the server process that result and send back to the client finally the results are shown to the end uh, via the user interface to the client and the results shown at the user end in the user interface okay that's all make sure the like button subscribe to the channel for more like this and thank you so much for watching i'll see you in the next one